tonight. Not gonna let the bug the park. Ah! Like they say. I will. I will. I will, Frank. Thank you. <laughs> as long as I have you in my corner, I think I'll be good. I'll be good. You got my corner. Well, so happy. I can't believe I'm actually meeting a a Grammy winner. Even an a, a, alumni from American Idol. It's, it's just fantastic. You are so sweet. So uh, Jordan Sparks is gonna sing tonight. Are you gonna be dancing to her songs? Oh yes. Yes, good, uh, good. I hope everybody's up there dancing. I'll be dancing and so will my girlfriend. Yes! <laughs> Tell me why it is important for you to support this foundation. For me, it's been really intriguing, actually. I've learned a lot since I actually just got here. I knew a little bit about um, what happens and people with Down syndrome, what they go through and different things like that. But I've learned so much just right before um, you came here. And uh, for me, people should always have we should always be, let me rephrase, people should always have the chance and opportunity to live a beautiful life, to have a beautiful quality of life, to be able to have access to the same type of health care, to be able to love who they want to love. And so to be at something like this, to be able to see what Global is doing in terms of health care and research for people with Down syndrome, um, it's really incredible and I think the more that people know and the more that people are given information and are able to, to see and to learn, then it makes people want to open up to be able to share or do something to, in their, within their power to be able to help facilitate those things. And so I'm excited to be here to be able to perform for them to have a great time, but also to, to learn. I want to learn more and I want to know more as well. And anytime I can be somewhere that is um, pushing the needle or facilitating change for people, that, those are the places that I want to be in. So I'm really, really happy. What's going on with you, with your career, Thank the tour? You. Okay, so, okay, Call My Name came out. Call My a, Name. A couple, oh, no, you're fine. <laughs> a couple months ago. And um, it's been really fun to, to write this music at this point in my life. I have a lot to say. I have a lot to do. I know my purpose on this planet is to use my voice to heal and bring joy to people. And um, so I'm just really excited for people to hear this new music. It's not like they've heard me before. It's a little bit different. There's a lot more live instrumentation in, within the music. Um, but my voice is better than it's ever been. And I'm excited for people to be able to hear what I've been able to do with my voice and how it sounds now. And also with my writing. I wrote on every single song. And um, it's, it's my story. And so I'm excited to see how people relate to the stories that I've written. How does it feel to get the award tonight from the Global Down Syndrome? Well, you know, to me, first of all, it's all about human dignity. That's what it's about. But everyone on this who is born, especially here in America, has had the opportunity to live their fullest life. That's what this foundation is about. And although I am thrilled to get a recognition, the recognition really goes to all the people behind the scenes, the people who are supporting the foundation, and of course, the champions that we are trying to lift up tonight. I love it. And you know, we're about woman empowerment. Who has been your inspiration to get to you are today? Well, there are a lot of great women who have inspired me, but of course it's my mother. 98 years old and still every day encouraging me to do my thing. 